three, two, one. Hello once again, YouTube. <laughs> Welcome to another another Target visit yeah. with the domain. Oh, we got a Target. Yeah. <laughs> what was my? Tell yeah. us. Tell us. I bet you can't possibly tell me what we're looking for right now. We are looking for series fifteen. Halo Heroes. Halo Heroes series fifteen, my guy. Um, <laughs> Did you hear me say that immediately? Go right, right, right. right. Um, what was that? <laughs> Correct. Yes. So many <laughs> failed attempts. So many empty targets. So many store shelves just filled with one or two marine snipers and nothing else. Dude, we you found don't love marine snipers, dude. We found more buildable energy swords than anything else. Wasp onslaughts, chopper takedowns. No Halo heroes. No blind bags. I did a Halo heroes hunt with Strandy42 on Instagram. Please do go follow him. He's a great guy. We went on a hunt about a week and a half ago. Came up completely empty. Well, we got a lot of cool Halo stuff, but empty-handed on cool heroes. Friendship. Right. And a couple of days ago, I actually released my full review of Heroes 15 because a guy called Emma's Customs on Instagram sent me a set. I wonder, so we just pulled up into the Target and right across from us is someone sitting in their car with their lights rolling right into our front window. So my first thought is, do you have any idea how crazy these people think we look? <laughs> Very crazy. Very crazy. Very Kellen, very crazy. can you tell me exactly what we're looking for in Heroes 15? Well, the lights of San Helios. Yeah, you got it. You got it. <laughs> it's the lights of San Helios, Agent Locke, Decimus. We don't know why there's another Decimus. Decimus is dead, him. dude. He's a dead character. He's Stop dead. releasing Halo Wars 2, he's dead. <laughs> <laughs> um, Was he like the main bad guy in Halo Wars No, 2? just uh, Atriox's general. Like on, oh, I knew yeah, Atriox was on the, the worst arc. guy. Yeah. yeah, Atriox isn't dead, so... No, we'll see. So we're gonna head into I don't Target because I haven't played it yet. Because Simon hasn't downloaded the software to capture all of my play. That's why we don't have that yet. I've been waiting and I've been wanting to play. He's been waiting to play uh, Halo Infinite for sure. So let's get into that Target and uh, cross our fingers, cross our toes. Heroes 15, pretty excited. I think it's kind of likely we see it. Apparently they've just been releasing all over Minnesota. But then again, this store is not usually the best for Mega, so we're gonna see. Jackpot! Yes. Yeah. Halo Heroes. No, no, no. Where's, the, where's, the, where's the real hero? Oh, I see him. Oh, the lights of San Helios. So we got Decimus. <laughs> like I said, there's always a marine sniper. <laughs> Even in the Series 15 box. We also have to chop the tip down. I'm looking at this. What? Lego Friends, the TV yeah. show? They'll make a Lego anything, really. Decimus, Linda, ODST Ramos. Agent Locke and the lights of San Julia. It seems like this bin has already not, not been picked through because there's still some of everything, but at least uh, quite a lot have been bought. And now uh, I do advise everyone across the US, you know, don't go to every single Target in your region and buy every single Lights of St. Helios, like leave them for other people. These are only uh, my second and third, and I definitely want a lot of them. But usually like if I went and saw a full box, I wouldn't buy all of them. I'd at least leave one or two, but this one only has two left. So they're going home with me. <laughs> all right, let's check the Jazzware, see if they got anything left. A Halo 2 Master Chief. That's all we got. This is all we got. I have spoken. Welcome back, everybody. Kellen, it must feel good for you to finally have a Lights of San Helios. You've been talking about this for quite a while, actually. <laughs> You've referenced it in the house many times. Yeah, I mean, it's clearly the coolest character I've ever seen that Simon's had. Right, exactly, exactly. These new not articulations. Even, it doesn't even feel like a hot take. It's, it's a, not a hot it's take. A, it's a tepid room temperature take. Yeah, I haven't shown you like all of my Halo, actually I've not shown you almost none of my Halo heroes and there are some absolute bangers in the cupboard. But as cool as this? I don't know. This is definitely the coolest elite. New articulation elite honor guard. As you saw in Halo 2 Oh, last I night. can open things now, yeah. guys. Ooh. And Mega have been doing a great job at massively reducing the amount of plastic packaging. Now it's just a small plastic wrap around the figure. 
which is way more. Hey, hello. Which is Dude, way better for the environment. You, get you know? you saying Helios out of here. Yeah, bro. exactly. <laughs> <laughs> They've had. Uh, well, actually, you saw in Halo 2 last night. We were playing it. You saw these guys in Halo 2. They look fantastic. Honor guards are mainly in red. These are a special kind of honor guard called the Lights of Sanghelios. Sanghelios is the homeworld of the Sanghili, which are the elites. The home guard. They're you know? the super elites. The super elites, maybe. The Elite elites? The elites of the elite. Elite elite. <laughs> the elites of the elite. First of all, there's so many things to talk about here. Honor guards, we have had different releases in the past in old articulation, including a white one in old articulation, but we've never had a white one in new articulation. We've only ever had two releases of the new articulation honor guard, one in red and one in translucent. It's been long since overdue. The only major change is they've now incorporated a brand new elite hand. Look at that, it's three fingers. So that's just for the elites now. And that's brand new to this figure and the 20th character pack. So very, very cool. Yeah, it, it's a great step forward, actually. Great step forward. Would you call this a trident or a pentydrant? I call it a staff. <laughs> Is that technically the third? But are you trying these little guys here oh, at the bottom? on the sides. Pentydrant. That's pretty clever. That's, that's pretty, that's, you got some good book smarts there, Cal. Big brain, big brain over here. The gold detailing on the armor is fantastic. I would have liked these shoulders to not have this plastic in between them so you could actually move these. Like it seems like just one uh, injection mold of plastic. When on the old articulation versions of these, these were like soft plastic and they could move. I also like how the skin tone of the elite's head is different from his jumpsuit. One thing I'm really wishing for now, which we've discussed before, they need to make painted head molds from Yeah, these. like, okay. This is such a sweet thing. Yeah. And then there's just no eyes. It's yeah. It's just like, like there's- There's holes. A, a, yeah, a hole. And also a hole in the head. I totally understand that you need this little pin here to insert into the head. And the hole means the helmet, it stays in place, especially when they're like loose in a box. But they need to release some elite heads that are painted, have no hole and don't even use a helmet. So you can have the occasional unmasked elite. I think that would be fantastic. For your- and I like as well how the staff is the same color, more or less to the uh, under grays of his gold highlights. A lot going on here. And they've changed the base plates of Halo Heroes now. They used to be every set of Halo Heroes was a distinct color. So you knew they all matched together. Now they've actually just got the uh, sort of clan that they're attached to. So that's the Office of Naval Intelligence. That's uh, the Banish. That's the Lights of Sanghelios. And this is Blue Team because she's part of Blue Team with the Master Chief. Yeah, so they've changed it up now. Yeah. Reach. Yeah. Yeah, reach, yeah, okay, yeah, yeah. Sure. And then that's the ODST logo. So all in all, he Heroes 15 is a fantastic wave. I'm not gonna army build a lot of these. I'm just gonna get a lot of these lights of Sanghelios. As many as possible without draining the supply. I wanna see like a, do you have some of the profits too? Yeah, I have all the profits. Come on, dude. I want, I think we gotta do the scene with the Arbiter. A diorama? A diorama. A diorama. Of the scene with the Arbiter coming in, uh, you know, as uh, the heretic. The heretic, yeah, yeah. As that the scene, master, yeah. yeah, like get, get um, him being stripped of his armor the two with tattoos. Do they have a gummy um, prophet? They do actually, yeah. See, the gummy prophet just acts as the one holocron of the three dudes. And the new, we watched last night. And the new Halo Universe blind bags have the Halo 2 brute from those cutscenes. So yeah, we need to recreate. Yeah. So this was another video with The Domain. Hope you enjoyed yourselves today. You stay awesome, you stay safe out there, folks. And the lights of Sanghelios are signing off. <laughs>